So, I did read up a little bit on this one. Mm -hmm. This is um, somebody's attempt at making a PS1 style-esque horror game in the vein of Silent Hill, like the first Silent Hill, Silent Hill 2, well, Silent Hill 2 came out on PS2, so never disregard that one. And, um, like, the first Resident Evil and stuff like that. I'm here to be. I'm Free J Fly. And we're playing Burned Memories. For Spoopy Scary Month. The month of spoops. Let's do this. Fresh meat. Normal. I like that normal is just, eh, normal. Hard and survival. Survival horror. So I guess we'll do normal. Space bar? Yeah, I'm like, okay, can we not? Okay, I guess we can't do normal. Okay, let's we'll do fresh meat then. Oh, this is interesting. Wow. Oh, we got tank controls going on. You sure do. Judging by the lanterns, there must be someone besides me. I admire the work that this person went into making it look old school, though. Yeah. I mean, it definitely looks like PS1. Yeah, this looks like we're playing it on a on an emulator. And the camera angles also work really well. The only thing that sets it apart, I think, might be the 60 frames per second, because I don't think our emulators can even play at 60 frames per second. Alright, bye. There are four different keyholes, each with a different icon. When I'd like to leave, I probably need the when I when I oh that yeah okay. four keys. It just seems like Silent a... Hill style. Silent Hill. Okay, so you got the Resident Door, Resident Evil Door thing going on here. So if it's going by a classic kind of um, PS1, there's probably not going to be excessive jump scare things going on. I mean, there might be some um, here and there. Yeah, I'm thinking like Silent Hill style jump scares. Books are boring, especially these. Wow. My character does not read books. Snowflakes are falling from the sky in July. Something is not right. Uh, how could you tell that from... The bookshelf. I He's looking look out, out the, the window. window. All right then, reader. I I definitely do get a Silent Hill vibe from this though. Yeah, and uh, yeah, like it says, it's definitely not finished. So I guess we'll just end up. Okay, playing. now now he's looking through the door and saying that. We're just gonna end up playing until like we get stuck or we get, can't move forward anymore. Can you interact with that? Okay, here we go. Note on door to cafeteria. I've locked the door to the cafeteria so that the students don't come breaking in the middle of the night to get a snack. They can get pretty hungry at night, it seems. The key is on the teacher's desk in room number 100. Please return it when you're done. Aoto Inoue. Cool. So I guess we gotta go get the key. Yep. So, mix of Silent Hill, mix of Resident Evil so far that I've noticed. Yep. 102. And I've already forgotten the controls, so. <laughs> well, can you? I can still feel the Zen floating around. Can you hold Very C no. and? I cannot. I can hit Escape. Well, go to Options. Oh, never mind. Oh. Uh, but in Options you can hold. Tank interact. To toggle torch. Okay, the lantern. Shift aim weapon. C to fire. Okay, that seems a little weird. Shift and C. Yeah. Huh. But again, because it's unfinished, I don't even know if we'll even get, like, a weapon. Mm -hmm. Picked up medicine. Looked like a soda can. I mean... <laughs> better than the chocolate milk that Silent Hill gives you. Uh, chocolate milk. Ah, uh, boring books. Gonna ring the gong. Boing. Nope. It's a wooden school table. It's strange that there's no chair around. Yeah, I feel you. Maybe they were just cutting back. What's more strange is that there's, there's a bench in this room. These camera angles. It must have been strange for the students when the school closed her doors. They never got to finish what they started here. Alright. So why is this guy in the school? That's what I want to know. Yeah, they really don't offer context. Oh, I guess there was medicine inside the drawer. Cool. Cool, I got medicine now. So you got two medicines. 
and an empty room. Q is to open your inventory, right? Yes. What does that look like? Oh yeah, it's definitely uh, Silent Hill. Silent Hill style. The situation. I am the situation. Key items. Memos. Memos are inaccessible right now. Cuckoo! I'm gonna think this is room 101. Which means the other room is room 100. I don't know when we'll um, encounter enemies or if we'll encounter enemies. What was that? I was gonna say, don't speak too soon. Oh, no. Oh, I guess that was probably some janky camera. Again, unfinished. So. Yeah. Cuckoo. It's an old clock. I can see a little shiny item stuck behind the little doors at the top of the clock. A little winding might help. And wind it. Oh, it's a puzzle. Big arrow, little arrow. So I'm guessing I have to set it to a certain time? Probably. Okay, none of those work. Big arrow, little arrow. I don't think so. I'm sure, that, yeah, there's gonna be a clue somewhere in this room or in this building that uh, tells me there's some more medicine in this drawer. Cool. Wooden school table. It's strange. Okay, there are no chairs around. What's that paper? It's in Japanese. Japanese. History notes from a student. It is the year 1993. I was one years old. Today, 358 years ago, the school was founded by Saki, Saki Ueda. That year opened the gates to success for Yamanashi and her inhabitants. We will always remember that year. It's extremely important to all of us, unknown student. Um, talk about teacher's pet? Who, what a nerd. Yeah, what a nerd. Who in school always was like, oh man, this school is so important to me. I love this school. I never want to leave this school, even if I were to somehow die and become a spirit. Mm -hmm. I want to be with this school forever. Holy son. I need the key to room 100 to open this door. There is a horrible smell coming from the other side. Time to fight some zombies. Cool, cool. Um, I think there was another door inside this room. I just want to double check. All my options before I moved on. I mean, that's fair. And I don't know, like, being the game is in development, I don't know how far we can get. Yeah, there's the door. There's probably nothing interesting behind this door anyway. You don't fucking know that. Alright, fine. Hey, check the chalkboard real quick. Uh, alright. Oh, I gotta mind. put my face right up on the chalkboard. Smudge it a bit with your nose. I don't. Well, we're gonna have to find the clue to it. It might be in a different room. Was yeah, there a little bit of uh, lag there? What happened? I don't know. Yeah, we'll check 102 and then. I don't know if we can just randomly pick out numbers on the clock. I mean, I kind of doubt that's the way you'll have to go about it, but. <clears throat> or maybe um, maybe that letter was a clue it's like oh this school was blah 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 it's very important to us yeah but 1993 and 358 years ago there was no date on it that would have been a clue Looks boring. Stay in school, kids. I got nothing. Well, we'll see. 
We shall see. Why? Because, I mean, as far as I know, this is like the only thing we got to go off of. But those are the only two numbers. Maybe try 358. Like, you can put 358 on the clock, no? Uh, no. It goes in like five minute increments. Oh, well, I'll try five o'clock. Or, sorry, three o'clock. It's not three o'clock. Mm -hmm. Try winding the clock. I mean, I got nothing after that. Alright, so I guess we're just gonna end up jumping this a bit. Until we can figure out the combination. Because I'm sure once we do, like, it'll let us know. Turning until something clicks. Oh. We got it. Yay. Hey! Did we get the thing? Oh, yeah, we did. A key fell out with the cuckoo clock. I can ima examine it by pressing Q and then going to the key items. Tab. Imagine being a char uh, like a game character that says that to themselves. I can do this to myself. If I press this button, I don't know what a button is. I mean, I do, just... <clears throat> I don't have any clue what it means by this context. Room 100. Alrighty. Cool, cool. Well. That's the situation. And there's something dead inside of it, apparently. We're probably Super gonna dead. meet with a big bad. Why? <laughs> The door is locked, but I do have the key. Alright, so I gotta actually select the key. There we go. Well, this just got really Silent hill us. <laughs> yeah. No, we're totally not borrowing from Silent Hill. Let me see. Must have been strange for the students when the school... Okay. <laughs> he... I'm not going to even be, like, a little bit weirded out by this. My god. It's a typical Japanese plant. It can survive for up to 20 years without water. But please feed your pan plants. Mm -hmm. I was about to say... Feed your plants. <laughs> A mannequin. Its lower body is human, but the rest is completely made out of plas- Oh. Well, I mean, you know, it's obviously gonna start chasing you once you start walking. Did- You picked up the key, so- Yeah, oh, okay. Did I pick up the key? I mean, it's not there anymore. Let me check. Yeah, look, a new key. This leads to the southern cafeteria. I can lock it to go in. But also lock it to make sure nobody- okay. <laughs> I was like, what? I can lock it to go in. Unlock it. Oh. Oh, here it comes! Oh shit! There's the door. You should probably check your life after that because I don't know if it actually like attacked you. Lock the door. Oh, a note! Let's no. Teacher abuses students for own side of- ooh. <laughs> The 53-year-old teacher, Aoto Inoue, was recently accused of torture by an anonymous student from Yamanashi Academy. She claimed that the teacher admitted that he felt satisfaction by simply looking at live female mannequins. Therefore, he would force his female students inside a mannequin's body during his classes, which led to serious breathing difficulties for multiple girls. The accuser started crying during her appearance in court, stating Inoue should burn in hell. Amaya Ito, 20th of February, 1990. Huh. It's a day after your birthday. And this was during classes? Yeah. And nobody said anything? Apparently not. 
Cool, cool. Oh god, it's fucking following <laughs> you. I mean, it was polite to have waited. Yeah. But hold on, hold on, I gotta read this first. <laughs> Calm down. So I guess turn around and use the key again once you, like, get in. Yeah. I don't even know if I had to turn around like that. It's now locked. And then you'll hear... Situation. Oh. Yeah, I'm not blue anymore. Yeah, you got hit. Wah. Good thing we got all this medicine. It isn't blood. It's some kind of molten red plastic. Maybe melted crayon. It is a school. This could be the art classroom. More medicine. Oh, wait, no, it's the cafeteria. This is a more, really... M more medicine. Can I not pick it up? Guess not. Are you spacing uh, it hard enough? Yeah, just gotta space it more. <laughs> okay. You don't need to convince me anymore. I'm guessing, judging by the music, this is a safe place. Oh, there's a medicine. More medicine. Judging by the music, this is a safe place. And I guess any place with the lanterns would be safe. And then watch it go wrong, and then bash down the door or something. Okay, so there is clearly medicine here. Why? He probably didn't set it up right. I guess I'll have to wait for the full version to come out. Hey, man, don't don't do fourth wall breaking. Immersion breaking much. Well, we can go through this door at least. Something hissed. Oh, hey, look at that. Ammo. Bullets. Now the walls are going to close in on you. I nearly got killed for the right... For the key that goes here. It's time to use it. What? I think you have to use the cafeteria key. Oh. What? It, it locked behind you. It locked behind me. <laughs> I thought you were going to become, like, you know, a Jill sandwich. Guess not. No. So that was weird. It just wow. locked behind you for some reason. I almost became a sandwich. I mean, not really, though. Uh oh. Hello, Change. darkness, my old friend. It won't budge. I mean, maybe because architecturally it's in the wrong place. Oh, there, there's a the snow. Ooh! I thought those were hands. They're gonna crash through the window. Just you watch. Just, just watch. Oh, yeah, if they're taking inspiration. Yeah. I'm ready for it. I am ready for those windows to break. They didn't break, and I'm kind of disappointed. More handgun bullets. More it's not bullets. like it's. Pre preparing you for anything or anything. I was like, yeah, give oh. me enough bullets, why don't you? Margot. It's Mr. Inoue's lifeless corpse. What did this to him? What's that? He has a folded piece of paper in his hand. My name is written on it. Oh. I don't know, it looks blank to me. Hi there, Hideo. Hideo Kojima? As you can probably tell, I took the easy way of letting myself out. We kept evil inside these will wills. We kept <laughs> evil inside these walls for six long years, but it's just too much for us. We can no longer stand against all the horrible things we've done. The bell outside is what brings these monsters back to life. Every time it rings, all dead martyrs will be running around again. Take my handgun, the handgun of a coward. You need to find those keys, Hideo. At least save yourself. Aoto Inoue. A nice, neat person. This man died six years ago. I was there at his funeral. I... I don't understand. Where am I? I think taking the handgun mm. is my best bet. You better equip that shit. <laughs> Because he'd be coming back. Seventeen rounds. When I reload, I remove all remaining bullets. So I should only reload when I desperately need to. Yep. Cool, cool. Watch him come back to life. Oh. <laughs> A 
kind of like that his yeah. casual way of raising it uh you're like eh I'll shoot you <laughs> dang <laughs> that is a weird control though holding shift okay now the glass is gonna break yeah now we got breaking glass no <laughs> I knew it bang 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 Fuck ah! Can you loot its body? That takes way more shots than uh. <laughs> it isn't blood. It's some kind of molten red plastic. I smell denial. <laughs> yeah, he's toy lying. Why hey, you stairs. always lying? Why the fuck you lying? You're not gonna go up the stairs? I'm going to laser. Oh well. I mean, if you need to go pee, I don't see a boys' bathroom, so this is your best bet. Women's restroom. I mean, I don't know any women's restrooms that has, like, a wire mesh platform. Yeah. Blood. Oh. There's the hole. That, I mean, do they just sit around it and just kind of do their business? Alright. No camera there. <laughs> Jump in. <laughs> Jump in? No, not yet. I want to go upstairs first. Is this where those monsters come from? We should probably, like... Uh, and not yet. I think you only have one. Oh, okay, never mind. I was gonna say, it better not give you, this is not funny. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is! It's like, oh my goodness. I nope. don't think you can use work. one. Oh, I guess we can only jump down the hole. We can explore. Wait, did you go? Oh, yeah, that's the right door. I guess we gotta go down the hole. Oh, it's completely black. I don't like it. Alright, yeah, I guess we're going down the hole. We're going down to sh the pooper. In, oh, two meters underneath the school. Two meters? That's that's a pretty um, long drop. <laughs> I mean, floating. your ankles should at least be broken. There's, wheelchair. There's a wheelchair. A wheelchair for children. What would it be doing down here? I mean, you know, hanging out, chilling, taking a smoke. Chillax. Door here. No. I... There's probably nothing interesting behind this door anyway. Fuck that door. Locks broke. No? Ugh. Silent Hill syndrome. Yeah. <laughs> Gotta love that syndrome. Can I reach this door? No. No. Moving on! I guess we gotta go this way. Two doors. Beds? Beds. Chairs. What's... Medicine! Strange camera angles. That's a ton of medicine. Yeah, but that's also a wire mesh preventing you from getting to it. Yeah. Can you examine the bed? This is a very dirty bed. Not that I am anxious to sleep here. So does that mean you would sleep there? I mean, I guess if I had to. Hey, I can't commentate about that stuff in the back. Nope. It's like, you know it's there, though. But I know it's there. Yep. Two meters beneath the room. It's shut tight. Maybe it's for the best. Well, can't argue Orders. with that. Oh, what is that? Oh, More it's another chairs. wheelchair. Oh. Wheelchair for children. Opening it shall not. It should be open it shall not. Opening it shall not just not, kind of sounds weird. Opening it shall not. More floating desks. Alright. What are we doing? What's that? Like, go back? Like, what's that on the ground? Or is that just like a hole? Uh. I don't know. I feel like I've been this way though. No, there's handgun bullets. More bullets. So you obviously have not been down this way. You well, go should I go down the center? Mm hmm. It won't budge. 
I was like, I'm just waiting for the point where we just start going in circles. I mean, we probably already are. Shut tight, maybe for the best. Um, let's see. I, yeah, I guess I don't have, really have a map for this place. Mm -hmm. I don't know if it does maps like Silent Hill. Oh. You <laughs> just casually raise it. Ooh. Is it behind me? No, it has to be in front of you. Or coming from one of the doors? I'm tired of this. Get some. Oh, I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> I'm out. Yeah, I'm out. Fuck you. You might want to take a medicine after this. Because, like. <laughs> <laughs> like, I can't tell when you're being hit, is the problem. The effects are mild. Ooh. It's molten plastic. You didn't try that door. Yeah. Uh-oh. No text. Now you go back. Huh. There's, there's the other door you didn't try. Uh, I, I that think one. I already tried that door. Seriously, no problem. <laughs> this guy's just getting fucking... Just sarcastic. It's like, fine, you know, whatever, no problem. I didn't want to go in there anyways. Probably some spooky... Some bitch in there. Dear player, this has been the demo for my upcoming horror game. I know that it is not a lot, and that this ending is rather abrupt. I am looking for feedback for all future ver versions and eventually a full game. I want to thank you a thousand times for playing and please leave any suggestions that came to y your mind. Thanks a lot, the final ending of this game won't be as abrupt as this. Noah Paul. Pow? I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing your last name wrong. Pow. It's an awesome last name, by the way, if it's pronounced Pow. Um, in terms of feedback, if you're watching this video, A plus on the p fact that you have managed to capture, like, the old PS1 graphic nostalgic feeling and hearkening back to, like, original PS1 Resident Evil and Silent Hill. Um, yeah, it's, it is, it's it's definitely got that uh that feel like Silent Hill and Resident Evil, especially with the way, it, yeah, the, the tank camera controls works. and the camera. Yeah, I guess one of my suggestions is is um make sure some of the cameras aren't as buggy as they are. Like some of the cameras do jitter around. If again, if you watch this, you'll notice where they are and where it kind of needs a little bit of fixing. Yeah. Um. I don't know. Uh, my opinion would be like, oh, I noticed that there was a bit too many items laying around. I'm sure that's for the easy sake, though. Yeah, probably. But, uh, I mean, it's the only um, mode that's available, and usually easy mode offers more ammo, more uh, health items. Yeah, so because usually I just play the games on normal anyway. So, so it's a little different, is basically what he's saying. Um, the other thing is definitely either add like, <laughs> if you're gonna release a demo and haven't figured out a um a hit animation or sound um just give it a sound to indicate that we're being hit and are close to death yeah because uh that that'll probably like throw a lot of users off during the demo it's like i think i'm being hit but i don't know because yeah. it doesn't really look like the um the enemies that are available are hitting the player either i'm sure you're working on it it's just yeah we know it's a work in progress but, but uh yeah, it's pretty good. It's very nostalgic. I do like it. I wish you the best, and I hope that maybe my fiance and I can play it later on in the future and um, get a lot more out of it. Definitely something we'll keep an eye on. Oh, yeah, definitely.